All right, we have Dr. Joe Landers here to answer your online pet questions. And I said the wrong name. I called you Bingo Buddy, but it's actually Banjo. Yes, this is B A N G O. Exactly. No, you have I'm to sing the song. Kidding. I'm teasing you. Yeah. He's a blue healer. He's a little blue healer cross. He probably has some terrier in him. He. I mean, he, he's, he's about five months old. He's got a lot of drive, meaning he loves to kind of do stuff. But boy, when you pick him up here, he's really being calm, which is pretty healer-like. And he's just a great little dog, very, very nice little dog. So he was found kind of wandering around by himself. So he's over at the Animal Aid Adoption okay. Center. Um, the, I think it's 794-6688. But got it. Great little, great little guy here. So Very cute. All right, sure we've got is. several questions from our viewers that they've sent in on our Facebook page. This first one comes from Regina. She wants to know, why do dogs eat cat feces and is it safe? My, my, my pat answer to this is, why do people eat guacamole? <laughs> um, unfortunately, yeah, um, uh, feces are a food source in the wild and a lot of them develop a taste for uh, 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 stuff, <laughs> you know, and, and so most of the time they kind of do that. Usually what you do is clean up the box as quick as you can and try to really just uh, avoidance is really the best thing. Sometimes put it in a place where the dog can't get to it or, or the cat or vice it, versa. No, not okay. at all. I mean, sometimes it'll upset their stomach. Mm -hmm. They'll throw up and they'll have a little bit, no. but usually as a, no, okay. not, not usually. All right, so. next question comes from Kim. Can you tell me how to break a dog from using the bathroom in the kennel? Yes, uh, usually if they start doing that, they're really being stubborn. So you have to be stubborn yourself. The kennel has to get smaller and smaller, so they have a choice, either pee and sit in it or hold it. Um, the other deal is getting out multiple amounts of time and also making sure that there's no uh, problem uh, as far as like if, if, if there's an odor to it or any blood or anything. Sometimes they'll actually have a urinary tract infection. And so you might want to test some urine or something just in case. Because sometimes when they do that, they really don't mean to. They just have to go. And, yeah. and there are some things that can be fixed. So for sure. So. All right. Our next question comes from Chris. What is the best way to teach a dog not to jump on you? This is a great yeah, question. This, this is a great question. And most of the time I'll tell people it depends on how big the dog is. But a lot of times if they're little dogs, <clears throat> as you go around, you can actually kind of take a longer leash than this. Come here. Come here. Sit, buddy. Come here. And you can actually kind of step on the leash a little bit. And as they sort of jump up, which that hit the middle of my shoe, it'll kind of keep them from kind of jumping up a little bit. The other deal a lot of times is you can kind of put up your knee and kind of turn from them a little bit and right. also teach them to sit, okay? okay? And sit for a treat or something so that when they come up and they actually want to kind of jump on you, then they're thinking, oh, I'm supposed to sit and kind of go for a treat. And after a little while, they'll learn pretty quickly that that's not something you yeah, want to do. No so no yeah. jumping, yep. yeah. But right. the leash under your foot a lot of times will really kind of help because they'll jump up and they'll kind of catch themselves and they'll be like, oh, well, after, that's no fun. After a while, yeah. they won't like that. Absolutely. So. All right, Dr. Joe, great Thank advice. You. If you're interested in adopting Banjo here, such a great dog, you can call the Adoption Center, 918-794-6688. If you want to learn more about Heritage Animal Hospital, see other pets who need good homes, or just see this segment again, go to our website, kjrh.com.